Sorry. It is. I have you seen that? It's a 4:30 in the morning, and I'm whispering. Sorry. It's my coffee pot. I'm whispering because I don't want to wake up my husband because it's so early. I am about to go on a 17 mile run and I decided to try to go at uh, early so I could be done before everyone wakes up. <laughs> oh, it's Saturday. Um, I'm also coaching my daughter's soccer team today so it should be a fun day. food but seriously those are amazing on runs because they're easy to eat and it's real food and it tastes good and but I don't have any of those today so I'm just gonna see how I do with this um, I always bring more food than I need because it's just better to be safe than sorry so I also put one of these tablets in my water I took my sport legs took two of these this helps with lactic acid buildup, um, so you don't your muscles don't get that burn as quickly as they would without this. Um, I took my Sport Enercine from Neo Life. This has amino acids and gives you energy and stamina. Really good. Um, so I'm bringing to both these waters, and then I'm also going to bring this water. Um, last time I ran out of water, so I'm bringing more water. This isn't an ideal water bottle, but it's all I kind of really have, so at least I can kind of clip it to me. But if you guys have um, ideas, like if you guys know of good water bottles for running, like ones that you can hold easily, um, let me know in the comments. Um, I got my headphones, and yeah, I think that's about it. I'm. outside so it's not too bad but it's, it's still pretty cold um, and then I have my armband for my cell phone and I think that's about it I'm wearing a long sleeve mesh shirt and then tank top under it so I could take this off and wrap it around me if I get warm so yeah leggings full pants 17 miles I got a couple more months until marathon day so we gotta do this we gotta do it oh. okay I'll see you guys out there you guys
guys can't even see. It's so dark out here. You can see some lights on buildings, but it's, like, it's so dark. There's the road. I have my my headlamp on. So I'm almost two miles in, and I'm actually walking right now because I started to feel really weak and shaky, and I have no idea why. Um, I ate toast this morning with peanut butter, half a banana. Shouldn't have any issues there. Drank a lot of water. The only thing I could think of is my body's just like a little bit in shock. Like it's really cold. Um, it's dark. It's early. You're supposed to be asleep. So I think my body is trying to tell me like go back to bed. <laughs> but I'm going to power through. I'm just walking for a minute and hoping that this passes um, quickly but I gotta say like it's really scary out here like there's there's an airport right there um, like I see eyes <laughs> I'm like that's a mountain lion that's gotta be a mountain lion there's a car come behind me um, but it's kind of scary being out here in the dark because it's like there's animals out here I'm on a main road right now but um, it's kind of scary, so anyway, I'll keep you posted on how I'm doing so far. Uh, a little rocky start here, but all right, guys, talk to you too. Bye. <clears throat> okay, do you guys hear that? Silence, it's so quiet. It's the animals, it's bears. Whoa. I feel like they're chasing me. I'm really scared. <laughs> so pretty. Sun's starting to come up. It's almost 6.30. I'm almost on mile eight. So I'm gonna show you. It's just pretty right there. Ah! We're getting there. Feeling much better. Kinda got through that that slump, eating a little granola bar right now, and uh, feeling good. All right, see you in a few. Alright guys, hope you can see me okay. Um, I'm going, I got about four miles left, so I'm gonna push hard and I will see you guys at the finish line. I'll give you a little recap of my run. Thanks for coming along with me. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, yeah, so let's do this thing. I did it! Whew, 17 miles done. Ugh. Went a little bit slower than I wanted. My pace was about 10.30. I was hoping for around 10, but we still got two months to improve, so we'll get there. Um, my pace at my last marathon was 11.30, so definitely improved from that, but um, still have a lot of improving to do, so but that's why we do these runs. Uh, the last couple miles, I got a good cramp. Um, I think a lot of it is mental. Um, the last couple miles are always the hardest because you know you're so close. Um, I did drink a gulp of water, so that might have caused it, but I felt pretty good throughout the run. The only thing really was in the beginning when I started feeling shaky, but I think that was just getting my body warmed up. Once I was warmed up, I felt really good. Um, started out pretty slow, and the last five, six miles sped it up a little bit. So that's good. I think my pacing was good. 
Um, anyway, I think it was overall a pretty good run. Um, and definitely, you know, for waking up at 4.30 and being out here in the dark for the first two and a half hours, um, I think I did pretty good. So thanks guys for watching and please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe for more videos. And um, thanks for going on this run with me. Stay tuned for more training and uh, all that fun stuff. So I'm gonna go eat, take a shower and stretch. Okay, hope you guys have a great day. Bye!